just made it to Oaks Garage. It's gonna be a super long week for a final bout. And today we're gonna start with doing the livery on the car. So I'm gonna put him on the spot right now. This is Mike from Toronto. What's up? Our boy. So he printed and designed the livery for us. And I'm thankful for him to come out here and you know install it for us and get the team together. So enjoy it now and it's glory because it's gonna get destroyed in a week. I guess we would go through the car real quick. So I went back to the original color that I first went with when I first built this car. Um, I kind of just went with it honestly because it was a little bit more cost effective and a lot of people really enjoyed it. And it kind of worked out cool because when we designed the livery, Tom really wanted to go back to his old color and I kind of wanted to use the old colors that I had from the old livery. So it's kind of like a revival, but- It just, might be slightly different. Yeah, sli slightly. <laughs> the colors. You, the yeah. colors, okay. Did it print different or just... I don't remember what it looked like exactly, so you'll see it. Okay, I mean, I either it way, it. it's going to come out sick and I'm stoked to look forward to seeing it on in a few hours, so enjoy. What's <laughs> up? Uh, so I'm Mike from Design Shop React. So we're doing Josh's car first because of timing and Josh, well, his car looks so far the best at this point because it's the only one I've seen now. Um, in terms of process and like how we go about delivery, basically I come up with an idea, hopefully it works out. If they like it, it goes through. But uh, come up with a design, hopefully see what their colors are like, if they like the colors, if it works with the paint. Um, in this case, you can see the pink and the blue. Uh, more purple, I guess. Pays homage to his other uh, livery that was on it previously and um, blends it with the pink well. And then we have some other accents that are gonna go on top with the logos. They're a little bit different to sort of stand out. That's uh, pretty much it in terms of how the design is and what the coloring looks like. So we're gonna start with layering the base layer, which is all the shapes, shapes that I make um, in the different areas. And then once that's sort of laid down, it sort of all falls together and all the logos go where they need to go. That's pretty much it, nice and simple. I guess I just see something different. I think it's fine. Thank That's you. Good. See, you got good taste. It's like Wolver spray or something on it, but <laughs> it's fine. To be honest, that's the look. Look at that. Look at that look right now. What? A good look. Oh, what the fuck? He found another one. <laughs> How funny is that? What do you think of your work, man? It looks pretty sick. <laughs> I'm, I'm happy with it, very happy with it. I don't know how if he's happy with it because he's emotionless. Um, still, as usual. I'm <laughs> still, that, that's, I'm still. You, that's how you are when life is just difficult. I guess yeah. so. When you're friends with Tom, you become numb and emotionless. <laughs> but no, no, I'm happy, I'm happy with it. Still, took, a little, took me a little longer than I was hoping, but I am just, a little tired from other stuff. Well, yeah, you just drove eight hours and yeah. just got straight to work, so. Yeah, yeah you literally just drove straight eight hours. And you were like, fuck it, like, let's go. Got to it. And slept two hours. Yeah, well, 
Hopefully I get a good night's sleep tonight. Yeah. You earned it, because now you gotta do this car and um, it'll be yeah, but the thing now moving on to the other two cards it's easier because the first one is always the hardest. Mm. It always takes the longest because you're figuring it out. Also their kit maybe is a little bit easier. Well Tom has the same kit my, as me. My skirts will be annoying. Yeah. Yes, yeah, because your racing line. Your front bumper would be fine because there's not much on it. Um, but yeah, your your side skirts will suck. Yeah. Fuck, but we're gonna pack this shit up. This is shit. What do you th what do you think of this thing? Yeah, this shit fire, man. <laughs> that's it. Shit, this shit fire. Hey, listen, yeah, that's what it is. You know what I mean? <laughs> Top quality products. You know, you did a fire job. Hey, usually I'm uh, behind the camera, not in front of it. So. Yeah, it's a little weird now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's my shit now. Yeah, Thank you, you Mike. You gotta do the monkey man post. Thumbnail. <laughs> Yeah, we need the thumbnail. And frame. <laughs> <laughs>
when, 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 no, you don't. You <laughs> not. Right? You be a good boy, all right? Your car's you got, too. You got, yeah. you got extra doors now, though. Now. You got extra doors. Nah, man. I mean, if it happens, if it happens the good way, I'm okay with it. No, no dickhead shit. I'll, I'll, I'll pop it up for you. First time ever, my guy. I made 450. 800. God damn. All right, let's go look at it. <laughs> God damn. It's got valve covers from Dubai. What's up, baby? What's up, dog? What's up? I never seen a turbo that far. Oh, it's a turbo mic. Oh, the turbo mic? He's caught, he's making up for something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the big frame one. Too. You don't got, you don't got this thing. Oh, good. He's got a nice fogger system. Oh, just water from. Okay. Washing it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna get dirty when it's behind me. I might as well. You didn't need to wash it. Alright. What's this? What up, dude? Add this air test, man. Is that the ambient air test? What's this? I don't know. I like this thing. Not, not a big GS guy, but I like the body kit. I like the color. The Fimmin's sick. I love these cars too. Peep this shit real quick. Got origin. It's got the origin snake wing, the reverse mount. Keep that. It's like S chassis thing. I never seen one on one of these before, but looks pretty good. Yo, it's got fucking. It's got overs too. Never seen that before. That it like tailors down to the body kit. It's pretty sick. So here we got an R32 and an R32. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this thing is nuts. Honestly, this might be my favorite car here. I think just like the contrast with like the steering wheel, the seats, these wheels. I'm not even gonna pretend like I know what they are. I just know that they're very old. So this is like very, you know, traditional like all one Japanese magazine spec. But I don't even, I don't even like Zenkis to be honest with you. But I think like the the lids, the body kit, like everything ties in super super nice on this. This exhaust, insane. Honestly, probably like the best sounding exhaust for an SR. It's a GP Sports Exus F1, I think. Josh probably knows uh, Rev Gasm Josh. He has one too, but. Honestly, it sounds fucking sick, especially if you have like a tubular manifold or something not stock. Just the note is nuts. And I
about this, man. This Yo, is wild. This, this is fucking sick. <laughs> so right now we're in the Grid Life warehouse, apparently. I've never seen anything like this before. This is insane. Final bout has gone above and beyond and every year the caliber is just up, you know, like you can't, even, it's almost speechless. Like this is so crazy. I pulled up with Martino in his S15, seen Chob outside just points. He's just like, yo, you in. And then it looks like a regular ass like loading dock to a building. Boom, you pop in, it's all this shit. This place is so crazy. Like, the cars look nuts in here. Like, you know, it's like, finally feels like hard work really does pay off, and we ain't even drift yet. You know, like, all we did was meet up, do a couple highway pulls, and this is like the calm before the storm, and this shit ain't calm. This shit is heavy, this shit is crazy. Ethan, this one looks like yours. What? This one looks just like yours. Like mine? Yeah, bit. Big old technology. Yeah, my, my car's stuck in. No. And it falls right in like the stop of the location. Maybe. Bob Beck is in the paint. I saw the looking sticker. I was like, I wonder if they paint it. Today we're gonna go to Pequod's, we're gonna meet up with everyone again, probably have like a little mini meet outside. After that, we're gonna go to TF Works, so we'll probably get a shop tour. We go little check video out of that. Yeah, yeah, we could check out all the shit with stand suspension. They have all like the in-house like dynos with the shocks and everything. Then we'll probably go out to the city after, so it's gonna be another long day, so stay tuned. <laughs> what is this? Oh rocking with the Shot Town pizza? Nah, I'm just starving right now. There's fucking like lunch meat ham on here. <laughs> Not feeling it? Hell no. Set it, set it in Jimmy's video. How much more can we do? Look at the ratio of dough, sauce, cheese. What? Oh my god, that's actual. You think it would taste like something, but it don't. It really don't. Look at what it. So right now we just made it to TF Works. As you guys can see, the shop is amazing. This is where they house uh, Stance Coilovers, Origin Lab. They also have a case swap kit, which is over there. You want to take a look at it? Martini. I know I thought. 
This is the first time I'm seeing this in person, so it's actually pretty sick. But, I guess this oh, this is for an S13. That's chassis. It's sick. So this is where the magic happens. This is where they do all the stance coilover stuff, the fabrication and everything. So aside from it being a part shop, they also work on cars. They do alignments. They do general maintenance, fabrication, cages, all kinds of shit. But I mean, look, it's fucking, it's a huge facility. Like they got this. I think this is like one of the, uh, their time attack cars. I think this car is a uh, K in it too. You get at 3,000, to sell. That's what causes it. Yeah. You want to hear the vibration of a K24. They always add the, these like combinations. That's the color of my really uh, really It's close. <laughs> it's actually a minivan. Oh, shit. Yeah. It's actually JDM. Listen, simple. Yeah. Uh, this guy's name is Chris. Yes. Right? Chris. Yeah. Chris. Cool Chris. Yeah, yeah. He competes in uh, the D1 SL series. A lot of room for activities in there. Yeah. 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 I mean, this is, He just wanted it to just beat, be, let me beat the shit out of it. And just go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good pink. It's a final round. This is crazy. Right MGT4s. Red Seat. This is.